Hey guys, Moshe the Electric Israeli is here and thank you for joining. Uh, I don't know if you had a chance to look uh, and now the Tesla Model Y estimate time for delivery is cut to four to eight weeks. Now you may say, what's the big deal? Well, it used to be, hello, it used to be uh, eight to 12 weeks, uh, not too long ago. Uh, and now that Tesla factory reopened, it's now cut to uh, four to eight. By the way, Tesla Model uh, 3 and Tesla Model S and Tesla Model X, also a uh, time estimate for deliver, w delivery was cut three to five weeks. So the question is why? Model Y is a brand new car. There's, is there a demand issue? So the two, two things that could be a possibility. Tesla uh, factory was shut for about a month, maybe a little bit over than a month. Okay, and then uh, after it was shut, it's, it, it is known that Tesla was doing a lot of upgrades, maintenance, you know, to increase efficiency. So now that it's reopened, I assume that uh, manufacturing is exponentially uh, better and more efficient and, and, and you know, uh, Tesla Model 3 and Model Y uh, share a lot of the same components, this, that, the other. So obviously they can deliver it much, much, much faster. Or there's not enough demand. There's not enough demand. Now, let me tell you something interesting. Let me tell you something really interesting. When I ordered the Tesla Model Y, I don't know, maybe three months ago. That's it. I did not, I waited until I, deliveries kind of started to take place, which was March. Okay, so by March, but three months ago, I put an order. Maybe a month later, before the factory was shut, a month later, I got like a uh, text, email, phone call, uh, you know, preparation for delivery. And then the factory got shut down and, and uh, you know, transportation has a problem, stay, stay at home, or shelter at home orders and all that. So I understand. So everybody got had to wait. But now that it's reopening and things are moving along uh, in terms of traffic and manufacturing and all that stuff, so people are getting their Teslas. So why, why was that three months ago? You know what I mean? Like. I did not expect to get my Tesla, well, why, for at least a year. And I was fine, cool with that. I'm getting my Tesla next week. I'm very happy. But what I'm saying is, is there a demand issue that dates back to where it was, you had to put, you had to put down $2,500? I don't know. I, I am sure, I'm confident, and I'm sure that Tesla, when, when it's all said and done, this, this crazy stuff that's going on, that Tesla Model Y is going to be an extraordinarily popular car, really top seller. I really believe them. But maybe it isn't at this point. Maybe I'm totally, totally making it up. So what what is going to give us the answer is obviously the result of the um, uh, second quarter. Now, obviously, the result of the second quarter are not going to be good for any company, for anybody, because it's just there's nothing was going on. So maybe the third quarter and definitely the fourth quarter will tell us what is the demand of the Model Y. But I have a funny suspicions that maybe it is a demand issue. Maybe, I'm not sure, I hope not, but maybe it is a demand. Let me know what you think. Thank you guys for watching. Put your comments below and I'll see you tomorrow.